welcome this is part 4 of hyperion codi fibaro integration with the software part we have covered in part 3 so continuing with that once i hit the send config button on the ras to the raspberry i can give a stop just to make sure that uh, it's not already running an instance right now then i hit the start you can see a rainbow sequence this shows that the hyperion effect has been fully initiated you will see this rainbow effect every time you reboot the XBMC Kodi because it will reboot the Hyperion also. Now the next part is integrating it with Fibaro as a virtual device. You can get a copy of this virtual device from this video's description. Once you import it, set the IP address for the virtual device as the XBMC Kodi IP and port number is 19444. When you push the Kodi button, the top Kodi button, it will set the Hyperion effect that is, that is the lighting will sync with the display screen. We will see that now. Yeah, you can see the lighting is synced with the display screen. So the next thing we can do is if we want to test the LEDs are in place. That is if you have configured the Hyperion Hypercon software right you can this, you use this video in YouTube called Simple Dream Screen Ambilight Test. I have the YouTube add-on here. I'm going into the YouTube add-on and I've already had this video. So play this Simple Dream Screen Ambilight Test video from XBMC Kodi. So once you start this video, So the video is starting now. So once you start this video, go back to the Fibaro virtual device. Press the Kodi button. This will reset the Hyperion to the default effect. That is the light matching with the display screen. I am fast forwarding the video now. If you have matched the LED sticking pattern correctly with the configuration in the Hypercon software, the LEDs will match perfectly as you can see in the video. Okay, so this is how I, I usually test with the whether the ambilight uh, LEDs are stuck correctly in the proper uh, way. So now to reset the light effect to ambilight, pressing Kodi button is enough on the Fibaro virtual device. Apart from this, we can have a lot of other effects also. Uh, for that, we have the other buttons. For example, if you want a red effect, you can click the red button on the virtual device. You can notice that the LEDs now ignore the amb ambilight effect and just switch on the configured uh, uh, light, red color effect. You can match this with other Fibaro red scenes around your home. There's just a use case. Same thing goes for blue, green effects also. Or you can use a slider just like you would use with Fibaro RGBs and have a customized combination color. Apart from these, there are also other effects like uh, the Knight Rider effect. It sort of gives you a red movement. You can watch the red movement. Another effect is also the fast swirl. That is the usual rainbow swirl that you get while you are booting up the Kodi Hyperion. There's also other uh, effects for parties like white strobe, blue strobe, etc. etc. Hope you understood the integration part. Thanks for watching. If you have some queries, do mention in the comments below. Thank you.